What's good y'all? Happy Saturday. Today is July 8th and we're going to be heading to the Pins and Patches Expo located in Anaheim, California. This is currently the line for parking at the convention center. Parking is also $20 at the convention center. Alright, so we're at the convention center. There is a really long line to park. You see it right behind me. But we parked at the Garden Walk. It's about $3 an hour and you get the first hour free there. But I think at the convention center here, it's $20 for parking. The Garden Walk is also about a 10 minute walk to the convention center. So if you're gonna wait in the line for parking, you're gonna be sitting in that line for about 30 minutes. They also have a food truck here, Nostimo. It's a Greek Mediterranean cuisine. All right, now we're about to walk into the convention center. All events, this way, baby. Let's get it. We're here for the Pins and Patches Expo. Damn, we got locked out. We are in. Look at Mew and Ninja Turtle. Look at this teenage Mew and Ninja Turtle. That's a line for the merch right here. So we're inside now. Usually they never check your tickets and I usually never RSVP, but this time they're actually checking your tickets here. So make sure if you guys come next time, RSVP. Tomorrow. Avocado? Oh, oh no. Pointers. That looks like the solid straw though. Go. So Katie's thinking about getting four earrings here. Four for 20. They have some cute selections here, such as some Sanrio ones. Look at these though. <laughs> Some lollipop ones. But which would I put back? I like them all. I don't think I would wear these though. They're too big. I'm getting these ones, it's the cinnamon roll one for my sister. And then these ones for myself. In each one of these, it's like a different picture from the film. And then you get one of these, and then it clicks. And then it changes, and then you can look through here to see the picture. So then you can color on the Dancing Patches Expo board here. I was the first person to color on this. The first person to color on the board right here. Okay, we're done with the Pins and Patches Expo. There wasn't really much that we were looking at. It was just a lot of clothes, pins, and hats. So we're just going to continue on with our day. There weren't a lot of patches there either. There were definitely no sunny, stickers. definitely no sunny angels. There wasn't much talking going on in there. There was a lot of music playing, so I didn't really get a lot of clips. But I'll probably just put them all together and put some music on it and show you guys what I saw. Today we're gonna be trying all my tea cafes located at the Anaheim Garden Walk. Today we're gonna get the strawberry matcha. Strawberry matcha latte. God. <laughs> So we got the strawberry matcha latte from, this is not the name of the place that we got it in. <laughs> I guess they had a rebranding. Um, the straw does not fit in here, but it fits on this side. Let's give it a try. Strawberry matcha latte. Very good. Um, the matcha isn't bitter. It's really sweet. It tastes good. You taste the tea. refreshing. You can taste the tea and the milk. So after I made the observation that you can taste the tea, um, strawberry matcha lattes aren't supposed to have tea in it. Just to let you know. <laughs> so no? this, no. <laughs> strawberry matcha lattes are supposed to be like matcha powder and then you put it with um, like sugar, a little bit of sugar, and then you literally just add milk. But this has tea in it. It tastes really good, but it's not a strawberry matcha latte. <laughs> Overall, I would give this a three out of five. Yeah, it tastes really good though. All right, we just pulled up to the Ikea. We're gonna go see what they got. We're just looking for some jars to hold our stuff in and uh, any cat stuff. We picked up some jars to put some items in here. And we also got a storage unit here. So in America, you actually get paid to check out yourself. Why else are you checking it out yourself? Because I don't want to talk to people. 
Nope, I'm antisocial. Because you are an IKEA worker. So that is the storage unit that we got right there. So we pulled up to Eco Town. They have some vintage stuff in here. We're gonna see what they got. I'm here looking for some camera accessories. They got some sunglasses for sale here. Vintage plates. Some shoes. What kind of shoes they got here today? They don't have the ones from Eco. No, oh, it's it sold out. Oh, there. Are these ones. Size 10. One fifty. One fifty. I like these. What the hell? Vans. I'll keep this one. Oh look, they sell printers here. I'm not buying a secondhand printer. Okay. That Duffy. Wow, it sells the tag on it. Cool. Wow. Duffy is a friend for only twenty five dollars. This Brand Hong new Kong from Shanghai. From Disney Shanghai. What they got in here? Derek Fisher. Oh. He's wow. You know, my my brother used to have this. They have he George? To, yeah, he used to have Derek Fisher, Devin George, and Rick Fox. He did not have oh, Jerry Payton though. Payton. He had these three. You should get him this to surprise him. I so mean, he doesn't have these three anymore though. What happened I feel like to them? he lost them. This shit goes crazy. Wow, this is cool. For only 40 bucks. I mean, you can't use that anymore. But the rest of the stuff shower is cool. Show. <laughs> yeah. And you see here they have rows and rows of clothes. Vintage clothes, college clothes, whatever you can find. This, this looks like it was made back in the 60s or 50s. Would you wear that? Yeah, it's so cute and I love the little jacket. These right here are in my size and I kind of want them. But I don't think I'm going to get them today. They're only charging $30 for them. Size 7. Oh, I found this two pack of lenses. We got the telephoto lens and a wide angle lens. But it's missing the 62 millimeter ring adapter. The one I ordered includes that one, or it should include it. I'm really excited to get that one. They're Gucci, right? Oh, look at the side patch. Look at this SpongeBob. This thing was crazy. They got designer bags in here, too. Disney Kate Spade. My girl Clarabelle the cow. Oh wow, look at this lounge fly here. Look at the other side. It's $80. Ooh, it's a Mickey Mouse one. It's only $80. You got this one for $60. Wow. This was literally $12 at Company D. Oh, wow. $800 for the Gucci Donald Duck. I like the Gucci strawberry. Yeah, $9.50 for that one. I like this one. The Rio Rainbow. $800 for that one. Wow, I want a Chanel coat. Like, that's so bad. But $3,500 is crazy. Okay, so we just finished up in Eco Town. They had a really lot of cool stuff in there. But we didn't get anything. But we're just gonna continue on with our day. Alright, we're pulling up to Ulta. This is the last stop. We're just here to get our face and skincare routine items. And we ordered it from Mobile Pickup and I think you should be Gucci. Thank you. Thank you, YouTube. Order picked up. That should be all. If you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe.
Thank you.